Good morning, good evening, good night. Whenever you guys are watching this video, first subscribe to my channel. Okay, a lot of people have been asking me about uh, food trucks or food trailers. Should they get a food truck or a food trailer? And to be honest with you, when I got my food truck about three and a half, almost four years ago, um, my, the hardest decision we had to make as a family, should we get a food truck and food trailer? And we decided on a food truck. And I'm gonna tell you why we decided on a food truck and I'm gonna give you the advantages and disadvantages. I got a list here I'm gonna be reading off of. So the advantages of a food truck. If you go to events, we thought about it. If we go to events and that's what we wanted to do, it's easy to park and whenever we finish, we can just get on out of there. We don't have to wait to hook up a trailer, we just leave. And the second thing was fast setup time. With a food truck, it's fast setup time. You just go in, park, get out and you can start uh, doing your thing. And another thing we th thought about, you know, if we're doing lunch, if we wanna go from one building to another or one company, a uh, food truck would be the thing to do because a lot of vehicles be parked in a parking lot. So you, a food truck would be better. The disadvantages. The disadvantages of a food truck versus a food trailer. A food truck costs twice as much as a food trailer. I know that'll turn a lot of people off right there. They'd say, hey, I'm gonna get a food trailer. It's twice, a food truck is twice the expense, uh, twice the cost. If you pay $40,000 for a food trailer, you're gonna pay about $80,000 for a food truck. And another disadvantage of a food truck is vehicle yearly registration. So you got to do the vehicle yearly registration. In order to get registration, you got to make sure you have insurance. So that's another thing right there. Another disadvantage of a food truck, a mechanic expenses. If this thing break down, you're not gonna go out and try to rent another food truck. That'll be hard to do. Try to find somebody to rent you out their food truck. They got to clean it out and get everything, or you go and try to, so it's easier to rent a truck than a food truck. So the mechanical expenses right there and the storage of the generator, you know, you're limited in space on a food truck. So trying to find a location to store your generator to run your food truck, that's another thing. So let's talk about a food trailer. Let's talk about the advantages. Like I said, it's, first it's half the price of a food truck. Uh, number two, you don't have to worry about no vehicle yearly registration um, and all that insurance stuff. You still got to have insurance, but you don't have to worry about the yearly vehicle registration. And the third thing, if the vehicle break down, these are advantages. If the vehicle break down, you could borrow one from your cousin, your brothers, or your sisters, whatever, or you could go rent a truck so you can pull your trailer. So it's easier to rent a truck than to rent a food truck. So number four, you know, you could place your generator on back of your truck if you need to. If you're setting up, just put your generator on back of your truck and you can... And if you have to go and get something, you can always drop the trailer and you could go to the store and pick up some more stuff. So those are the advantages. The disadvantage is it's hard to park. Like I said, if you're going to an event and you want to get in and park, you need to move, or you see you, you parked in a bad location where there's no traffic. Once you're there and you, you, you really stuck because once you park your vehicle, you can't go get your truck and bring it back in and hook up because there's no space. I, it's a couple of times where we went to events in my food truck where no traffic and we was able to just get in and move around and go where the traffic was at. Another disadvantage of a food trailer is a, it's slower to set up. Like I said, you got to get there and you got to park, you got to drop everything. So it's slower to set up. And the third, like if you're going from, you want to go from lunch to lunch or building to building, and it's a lot of, vehicles parked there so trying to pull a food food trailer is going to be very difficult to move around those vehicles and park and so those are the disadvantages of a food trailer so if i had to get a second food uh supply a food truck or trailer what i would do would get another this time i would get a trailer i keep my food truck but I would get a trailer and set it up and let somebody lease it out or rent it out or run it for me. So those are the advantages and disadvantages of owning a food truck or food trailer. All right. Thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel.